Hello, my name is Alfredo, and this is Off the Strip, where I introduce you to places just minutes off the Las Vegas Strip or take you on one of my adventures. Before we begin, do me a favor, hit that like button to help this video's algorithm. Also, if this is your first time to my channel, please hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. More information is listed below. In this video, we are going to Portland, Oregon. It's so cold, it's so slippery, so icy, but I'm going to try it. Okay, I'm at Noma Falls in Portland, Oregon, trying to get to that waterfall up there, but it is so icy, so slippery, I don't have the right shoes on. You have to go down this little ramp down the hill, but that ramp is totally iced over. So I'm just going to have to enjoy the waterfall from across the highway here and, and call it a day. It is so cool. Okay, so with the help of some tourists with spike shoes to kind of help me down that ramp, and now I'm in this tunnel trying to get through. If you notice, everyone's walking on the left side because everything on the right is ice. Okay, so I made it across the highway. As you can see, on this side, So close though, look, it's so close, but um, it's so, it's all ice, it looks like snow, but it's all packed ice, so slippery, I don't have spikes on my shoes, um, I'm surprised I made it this far, now I'm just getting back to the car, so we'll see. Okay, so that was an adventure getting out of, of the falls. We had to go all the way 20 miles north to turn around because there were no roads that you could, or at the waterfall where you could U-turn. It was all iced over, no one could get through. So anyways, so we are starving. We just went ahead and put in seafood, near seafood and took us across the river. And now we're in the state of Washington to try this place out. I don't really know. If it's good, hopefully it's good. The next day we decided to go wine tasting. This was actually the second place we went to. The first place we went to was totally closed. It was in a barn, so it was kind of weird, but I'm glad we uh, ended up at this place. Okay, so after a bit of a drive this morning, uh, by the way, it's the second day in Portland. Um, we are gonna check out a couple of wineries. Went to Erie Winery first, but they were closed, even though the site and their voicemail said that they were open, but they, they, they were closed. Um, so we're gonna check out this winery. So this winery seems to be a really nice one. So we decided to go ahead with a flight. It's 50 bucks, but there's six different types of wines that you get to sample. Um, this place is just beautiful. So we're starting with the rosé. It's pretty light, it's pretty fruity, it's pretty good. So I'm about to try their Chardonnay, um, according to our, our guide here. Back in 2014, this was the number one Chardonnay in the world. Let's, tr let's try it. It's 
it's pretty good. I mean, number one, I don't know, but that was in 2014. This is a 2019 uh, bottle, but um, hey, all the grapes used in this wine was grown here in the Dundee Hills of Oregon. Okay, so our guy gave us a little cheat. It's a 2010 Pinot Noir, which is rated number one in the world back in 2010. And it is pretty darn good. Um, I'm actually on my second pour. Um, and we'll probably buy a bottle. Okay, so Domain Reserve um, Winery in Dayton, Oregon. It's it's pretty legit. It's pretty good. Um, we had a really good time. We didn't think we were going to um, stay very long, but we ended up staying almost two hours and buying three bottles of wine. It was really good. When I do return to Portland, Oregon, I'm definitely going to visit more wineries. The wineries are pretty good. They're known for their Pinot Noir, and man, let me tell you, it is pretty good. So after the long drive uh, home, we decided to grab dinner, and of course I forgot to film it. And after dinner, we decided to find Boba. So we're on Alberta Street in Portland, Oregon kind of a little neat street there's a bunch of like restaurants and stuff but we checked out this TNT boba place it's pretty good it's not a brew tea bar in Vegas but it's pretty good I do recommend it so this wraps up our video for Portland um, first time in Portland but I return absolutely Portland's beautiful I'd like to come back in the summer where I can actually go walk to the falls and be not as cold and slipping everywhere. So thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that like button and the subscribe button. This is fun. We get to walk onto the plane from the outside. <laughs>